How's everyone doing today? My name's Steve. This is our first video on YouTube. No, we are going to go through how to set a Rolex correctly. There's a couple of different ways to do it. Uh, I want to just go through it and show you how I feel is the right way. So, as you can see, this watch is already running, so it's been wound a little bit, but I'm going to go through the whole process. All Rolexes, most all Rolexes, have a screw down crown. So as you can see, the crown is what sets your time, and this one is screwed all the way down. We're going to unscrew it, and it pops out. You can see it's spring loaded. That pop is called the zero position. This is where you can manually wind the watch. So I'm manually winding the watch right now. To fully wind an automatic watch, you're gonna go about 40 turns. So next, what we're gonna do is, I wanna set the date. But before I set the date, these hands are in the wrong position. You're not gonna hear this a lot, so. Um, but this is the right way of doing this. You want to initially pull it all the way out. This is the two position. So we started in the zero. I'll show you a close up. One, two. This is where you're going to set the time. I'm going to put the time at 530. Anything below the three and the nine o'clock is going to be just fine. I, the southern hemisphere. So now I'm going to go in and set the date. So we're going to pull this out to the one position. I'll do it again closer. One. Now if I go clockwise on this, this is going to move the date forward. Okay, so we're going to set it to the day before we want it. So if we want it on the 24th, I'm going to set it to the 23rd. Now I'm going to pull it back out to our two position. And now I'm going to find AM and PM. So when this flips, I know it's midnight. Boom, perfect. So I'm gonna set it. I'm gonna set it to, it's about 3.30 our time. So this is noon, of course, we don't wanna see that flip. So now I know this is PM, one, two, three, 30, perfect. Now we've got our time set. We've got our date flipping at midnight and not noon. And the last thing I'm gonna do is make sure this crown gets screwed all the way down. And so we're back in the zero position. Again, spring loaded. So I need to give it a little push and a full, whoops, didn't grab it. On about a two to three turns. Now finger tighten this only. There's gaskets on the inside. That's going to keep it from getting water inside. So that is our quick and easy way to set your Rolex or any automatic watch. There'll be more to come. Thanks guys.